everyone and welcome to Cheap Meal Monday and today we're going to use my very old bread machine to make our meal. So stay tuned. It's about time I get my apron on, don't you think? And today on Cheap Meal Monday, what do you think we're going to make? Mamma Mia! We're going to make homemade pizza. So, let's get started. So the recipe calls for to make it in a bread machine. But you do not have to have it in a bread machine. You can use it in a mixer, you can use it in a food processor, or you can mix it by hand. So let's get started. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to add one tablespoon of yeast to one cup of warm water. To that, we're going to add a teaspoon of sugar. And a teaspoon of salt. Now, this bread machine only cost me 50 cents 10 years ago. And then two tablespoons of oil. Making bread, making pizza dough is so easy, and pizza is so expensive in the grocery store. You can make it so much easier by doing it by hand, and it's so frugal and cheap. To that, we're going to add two and a half cups of flour. And that's it, my friends. So what we're going to do is we're going to set it on the setting of dough. And for start. And I will come back to you in an hour and a half when it's done and then we're going to make the toppings. And the dough is finished. So we're going to get it out of our bread machine pan. We have the oven preheated to 375. We are going to roll it out on the table to fit a 9 by, 5, 9 by 13 inch pan. This dough is really easy to work with. And then what we're going to do is we're going to fold it in half. We're going to get our cookie sheet with parchment paper on it. We're going to transfer it onto there, and then what we're going to do is we're going to spread it out with our fingers, just like this. And we're going to pinch it out as far as we can. This recipe makes one pizza, but you can easily double it. Now, pizza is something that is so frugal to make, and really, it's so much better than store-bought, and even the restaurant, you can make it better. So what we're going to do is we're going to get, we're going to get our label, ladle with my homemade pizza sauce that is canned, and we're going to just spread it on the pizza, just like that. This pizza also has hamburger ground beef in it, this pizza sauce. So we're just going to, you want to put it on fairly thick, but you don't want to put it on too thick that it makes your dough soggy. That's perfect. And then we are going to top it with some shredded cheese. You want to put enough that you have it really cheesy, but not enough that it makes the dough soggy. This is very good frozen as well. You can make this and stick it in your freezer if you have a freezer. And now for the topping. We are going to try something different. We have toppings of sweet Lebanon bologna and some green peppers and some onions. So we're going to sprinkle that on top.
just like that. Toppings make things good. Also made a salad on the side. So we're going to have a salad as well. So you are getting all your veggies. This is what it looks like. And I'll put it in the oven. And it'll be about 20 minutes to 25 minutes. And I'll show you what it looks like when it's done. Well, everyone, the pizza is finished. So let's go ahead and let's put a little salad on our plate. And it looks really good. Here is our salad. Here is our pizza that we made together. I left it sit like five minutes, which you probably want to let it sit maybe a little longer, maybe like eight minutes or so. It's a very good dough. It's not doughy. It's actually crispy. salad dressing on. Just like that. This salad dressing is really good. I got it at Discount Grocery Store. It's Bistro Bacon and Ranch, but I got it for a dollar. Now for the moment we've all been waiting for. Homemade pizza that cost us very little money. And it's a lot better than the store-bought or the restaurant. Let's give it a try. Try it. It is really, really good. The recipe once again is one tablespoon of yeast and one cup of warm water, one teaspoon of sugar, one teaspoon of salt, two tablespoons of oil, and two and a half cups of flour. Bake at 400 for 15 minutes. And this makes one pizza. Take care, everyone, and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye! Thanks again so much for watching and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye!